Hey guys, my name is Tu. In this video, I'll be demonstrating how do we convert annex part built in matrix unit into English unit uh, while maintaining the size of the geometry. So, uh, let's begin with opening an assembly file. So, this assembly file contains five children files and if we quickly do a measurement for example the length of a single curve of this curve it says 4.9699 inches which is in the English uh, units so some people they prefer to read this value in a matrix unit so we will need to convert uh, this example into a matrix unit uh, and how do we do it Okay, so uh, let me just close this part and I'll show you the commands. So in the NX documentation, you can search for the phrase UG underscore convert underscore part. So this is the command available in NX uh, itself to help us to convert the unit uh, from mm to inches or vice versa. So here are some examples of using this command. I'll click inside it and it gives us some of the examples of, for example, ugconvert.part uh, minus i end a.prt is to convert and overwrite the file a.prt into inches. Furthermore, examples such as you can convert and overwrite all the parts within the sub uh, within the directories or subdirectories to inches or to mm you can also specify uh, the output directory as a different one so notice that this tool is currently located as the ugii folder of each version of nx so in the ugii folder you can find the ug underscore convert underscore part dot exe file here so I'm using NX9 currently so to use this file we will need to go to uh, there is an easy way we can go to the start find all programs search for the NX9 folder go to NX tools and click on command prompt so by doing this way we will it will automatically bring us to the UGII folder where you can directly specify the tool to use. So you will no need to find this directory uh, yourself. So I can quickly enter this command. .exe and I click enter. So this will give you all the options available on uh, how do we use this command? So I'll just quickly uh, use this command to convert all the parts uh, in this in this temp folder from inches to mm. But before that, I will just quickly do a backup. And okay, now we can just copy the directory from here and paste it on to before I paste it enter the setting the directory as the source and paste it so I will co convert all the files in this directory into mm and uh, thus minus mm as I press enter the conversion process is automatically on the on the go notice that it says all the files six files in total successfully converted now we can go ahead and uh, open the files and do the same measurement. So uh, previously uh, I was measuring this length here. So it says 126 millimeters. So if I quickly convert it manually using the calculator, to inches unit, it will give us 4.9699 inches, 
which is the same value from what we did me uh, measured previously. So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you.